So why is it so important that I'm believed? Well, mainly because the people who don't believe me have made it impossible for me to get help. See, I had a therapist, I had a doctor, I had medication. And only recently did I lose all of that because the cyber terrorists that have been trying to hurt me for the last year and a half contacted my therapist. They sent her death threats. They contacted the board to try to take away her license. And I can't live with myself knowing that another human being is receiving death threats and their career is in danger because they're trying to help me. So until the people who have been hurting me are acknowledging and accepting that I have these problems and this trauma and I deserve help, I'm not allowed to get help because if I go get help again, the same thing will happen. They'll start the threats and they'll start the intimidation and they'll do whatever they can to stop me from receiving the help that they no longer believe I deserve. That's why it's important that people believe me. If my bullies believed me and acknowledged me and allowed me to get help, I could go and get my therapist back and my medication back and I could start working again on myself. But I can't do anything while the people that hate me are screaming at me that I, my problems don't exist and they're not going to let me do anything except get a job, which I'm not capable of doing. They won't allow me to have a therapist. If they would have, then why did they, threat, why did they try to take the license of my last therapist away? You don't try to take away the the a license of a therapist that you believe is helping somebody and you want that person to be helped. You only try to take away somebody's therapist if you don't want them to have a therapist. That's the literal only reason somebody would have reported and tried to take away her license. That's why it matters that people believe me. If I'm believed, I'm allowed to have a therapist and get help.